Hello, and welcome back to our Skyrim Let's Play Path of Belazar Creed. Yeah, we are here by the Shrine of Azura. Man, that babe's got some tits. Oh my god. Well, not as fine as Yusuf here. That's, uh, that's for damn sure. So. Hello? Azura has seen your coming, traveler. It was not curiosity, but fate that has led you here. Actually, I think watch curiosity. Seeing my coming? What do you mean? Azura has given me the gift of foresight. I had a vision of you walking up the steps to this altar long before you were born. You have been chosen to be her champion. I know it is unexpected, but do not worry. It will all unfold as she has predicted. Mm-hmm. Okay, a gift of foresight. That could be um, misinterpreted. A gift of foreskin. I mean, uh, sorry. You must go to a fortress endangered by water, yet untouched by it. Inside, you will find an elven mage who can turn the brightest star as black as night. It is cryptic, I know, but Azura's signs are never wrong. I believe the fortress may refer to Winterhold. Ask if they know this elven enchanter. Yes, there were others at first, but Azura's visions tested everyone's faith. One by one, they left, afraid to know their own future. But I refuse to abandon the shrine. The visions are a gift. Azura warns me of tragedy, war, death. Before it happens, I won't leave her guidance. Cool. May Azura's magic protect you. Okay. So... College of Winterhold? And we already know who this um, uh, night, uh, night Elf is. Or Night Elf, why? Uh, Dark Elf, or what the heck you want to call him. Um, oh, yeah. Journal. This one. Wait a minute. Yeah. Um, it's the guy down at the main thing you are relatively new here are you not I have noticed you but we have not spoken no we haven't then allow me to introduce myself I am Savos Arin Archmage of the College of Winterhold I am quite content to see nearly any aspect of magic explored and investigated here but I do not and will not approve of any research or experiments that cause purposeful harm to your fellow members of the college. Understood. Are we clear? Yes. Now, if you'll excuse me. Of course. Let's go in and have a chat with the old guy. If he's even here. Uh, him. I have many important things on my mind. Your concerns are not among them. I am an advisor to the Archmage. The Thalmor wish to promote relations with your college. Okay. I am at the Archmage's disposal if he requires advice. Perhaps not as often as he should. In time, I believe he will be more trusting. Hmm. Okay, um... Yeah. Let us just go down to... Uh, the town and uh, go into the inn. Uh, 
I don't know if it was faster this way or <laughs> just running down. I think it was faster this way. You're that one from the college. Heard about you. Cool. A frozen heart. Ooh. Yeah, I've got uh, some wood. Hey. The mages don't let us go in the college. They said it's not safe in there. Hey. Are you in? Ah, there you are. My days at the college are long behind me, but I prefer to stay close by. Dagor and I have an understanding. He gives me privacy, and I make sure my experiments don't blow up his inn. Who sent you? Was it the college? The Jarl? We agreed there would be no more questions. A... A priestess of Azura sent me. Azura? Gods, it's all finally coming back to haunt me. What do you know about soul gems? Uh, soul gems... Why do you ask? They are for enchanting, correct? They are. Except the gem is always consumed. They're frail. Except for one. Azura's Star, a Daedric artifact that allows any number of souls to pass through it. Some of us wanted to find out how. I was working under Malin Varan then. If only we knew what he was really planning. What did Malin do? Malin wanted to alter the star. He was dying, disease. He thought he could store his own soul inside, become immortal. It drove him mad. Students started dying. Eventually, the college exiled him. He took a few loyal disciples to Illinolta's deep and vanished. Look, I don't care who asked you to find the star, but don't take it back to Azura. The Daedra are evil. They're the reason Malin went insane. Okay. Mm hmm. Um. Sophia, would you please? Sophia? Thank you. I told you what you wanted to know. What else could you want? Yeah. Okay. We know uh, for a fact with this quest. If I take the star. Hi. I, if I take the star back to Ashura, it becomes white. Uh, it becomes white and only uh, and only uh, non-people animals can be in it. Okay. Damn, that's a long way away. Sorry. Ah, the old crone's cottage. Yeah. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, no. Yeah, this is, this is closer. So yeah, uh, it becomes white, and only non-people creatures can uh, be, uh, st souls can be stored in it. Like mammoths and uh, trolls and stuff like that. But if you take it to him, it becomes black. Whoa. Fuck's sake, this is hurting me like a son of a bitch. Where is my... Fast. Here we go. Knew it. Whoa.
Oh shit, now they're coming after me. Uh, extra magic, no. This one, not this one. And a few of these. shooting at me. Whoa. She kill me. Sheesh. Oh my god. 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 Okay, we gained all that in level. Damn. Uh. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. What happened? Oh yeah, we went out. Yeah, okay, cool. And then we went to this place. Huh, lol. Corpse for the pile. Do you have something to say? Okay. I think we're gonna go on foot the rest of the way. I have a sneaky suspicion that uh, they're not gonna be the last. Wink. 
encounter of them. That's a freaking owl. All right then. Come on! That takes care of that. Another corpse for the pile. There we go. That was a little bit easier. Helbert, can we carry it? Nope, we can't. Uh, can ah, we are just overburdened. In all my years, I've, I've never seen I'm such a ears. thing. Well, not. Huh? You're no fun. <laughs> Okay, let me see here. We're gonna give her the the helper, which is <laughs> extremely overburdening. And some of this. And some of this. Okay. A gift of one who. Uh, 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 sorry, let me just take that one all over again. A gift for one of her. Foundering to vouch the cloak's rich quality, well preserved during the miasma. So it's only it's only worth a lot of money. You know what? Let's see here. I have something for you. Of course, I'm here. Oh, what is it? Let me see if, if uh, she takes it on. That could be cool. I want her to have it. Oh my god, she does take it on. And you look pretty as hell with it on. Cool. I got a, f a fisherman or a fisher woman down here. Nope. You don't suppose a human and a saber cat? No, nope, I'm not going there. People get a little touchy when they say that. He's like, what? Was there something? That's the place we're gonna go. Uh, yeah. Thistles! This looks like a cool place to have some fun. Sophia, are you with me? Are you coming? And they, those two are taking a bath. <laughs> Lord. Are you ready, Sophia? Let's jump in head first into the deep. Oh, yeah.
Huh. Fisherman's Journal. That's the wrong one. We need to go into this one. Then go into Forgotten Maddox. Pyromancer. Ah. Almost. Almost. Uh, for a new skill. Live to regret this. level up for my uh, hell yeah what should we take five star a chance of casting twice backdraft a chance to knock back the target does not work on dragons uh, unrelenting flame fire blast deals additional damage equal to eight percent of your current mana to the target havoc deals additional damage if the target is not attacking the caster. We are going to go with the knockback, I think. And let's just be a little bit safe. Let's save. And of course it dies out. Be right back and I will have this up and running again. And we are back, yeah, for some unknown reason, every time I got to this point, it uh, the, my uh, my game crashed every time I tried to save. I hope that is not because I'm putting this one in. Let's try and see if uh, I can save now. I just, I've just saved before this. Okay, now we can save. Cool. Weird. You won't even live to regret this. Cool. Wolf pack. Well, that's a new one. Summon a pack of wolves for 200, 120 seconds where the cast... Oh, we're gonna... Hmm? We're gonna try that one. That's under... I think it's Conjuration. There we go. Three pieces of wolf, nice.
even live to regret this! Good puppies. That takes care of that. Corpse for the pile. Good puppies. Nice. <laughs> Clairvoyance. Another corpse for the pile. Why you? Oh! Last mistake. Nice. Spell tome lightning bolt. Cool. Okay. Nice. Nothing much. Hmm. Okay, if I'm going up here. Nice. Yeah, I know, uh, we have reached our old wrapping up point, but uh, yeah, I'm thinking that uh, we are going to continue on. Let's just, just make sure that we can.
man, there's a tantrum sing song here. Oh, okay, she dispatched of him, cool. Second, there I just got the heebie jeebies. Lovely skeletons with all their lovely gold. Apparently, alchemists eat ingredients to learn how to make potions. That doesn't sound very pleasant to me. Hmm. <laughs> yep, I'll take that and one. Who in the right mind would eat a giant stow or troll fat? <laughs> Glass armor. Yes, thank you. In all my years, I've, I've never seen such a thing. Okay, I think we can get up here. Oh, yeah. Cool. Okay, now I have two choices. Either go to uh, Strand of Ashura or bring the star to. Okay. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna do the right thing because Ashura may be a Daedric, but she's one of the good ones. So we're gonna take the star to her and get it cleansed so only. Uh, we can only have white souls in it. But, the epic battle we are going to face here is going to be have to be done for another time. I would like to say thank you all so very much for watching, and as always, catch on the flip side.